Hello and welcome back. We're ready to take on Dr. Waiwi. Everybody your phones your alert. Plugs. If you're wearing earphones, take them off now. You have been warned. Ah, make it stop! What? Make it stop! I, I can't don't know what you what? guys... I don't know what you guys are complaining about. It's not that bad. That's because you muted it. No, I listened to it actually before... a smart move. I actually listened to it beforehand just to get an idea of what you guys were talking about, and... It wasn't that bad. You know what yeah. is bad? Let... <laughs> I was yes. just forgetting that you can just freeze these guys. I know, but I I get conservative with my ammo. Ozzy, Alice. three shots. It's not that much. Also, you can kill them with the... I want to say LA command weapons with like a one shot or something like that. Well, oh, but you'll freeze those. It's it's a Lechman's weapon. Y you have to freeze those. There's like one pixel, one frame that you cannot freeze them. I can. I can do it without freezing them at all. What the fuck? Okay. Part of how good this game did you guys forget? Twelve. There, I just said, screw it, restart it, let's try that again. I was on my last life anyway, and I knew I was gonna game over at least once because of Copy Robot. Okay. You mean the but second easiest boss? On the recording. Which I don't mind because I'm counting your deaths. And you lost your yeah, score. keep it accurate. Uh, I hate big guys. Also, uh, one thing I will say, uh, before we go further in, I hope you picked up the magnet beam! Well, to go back to Battle Network for a moment, they actually had all these care, all these robot masters in the games. Uh, yeah, actually, I do remember that. Some of them worked a bit differently, of course, but... Ah! Well, that... That room right Please. there! Yeah, uh, the fleas got ya. Ozzy has fleas? Eh. No, that's what he right knows home. now. Actually, those okay. are like hoppers. Yeah, the fleas like, there are what? really dickishly positioned. Anyway, for Battle Network, I think all of them actually benefited a lot from their redesigns, with the exception of Chuck sure who just got a big C on his chest. What the hell? Yeah, screen wrap. Yeah, you can screen wrap a lot of things in this game. Oh, so he's, not good, he's not good enough to actually do it, so he's cheating and glitching things. Yeah. yeah in the first By the way, remember what we said about those uh, flyers ice, in Iceman stage? <laughs> I told you they were bad. Yeah. They are RNG the enemy. Not to mention, if it, they're moving down, sometimes their shots decide that they uh, hit you anyway. And then there's the fact that they fly too high in that room, guess what's directly above you? I'll give you a hint, it starts with an S that ends in a, your head. Yeah, anyways, that room right there, you need the uh, magnet beam to even get past it, so I hope you grabbed it. And our, you know what, I don't think the robots in this game are big enough, we need a bigger one. Matt, you fool! Oh, come on, that's not nearly big enough. Okay, now we're starting to get big enough. There we go, that's a big enough robot. Yep, say hello to the Yellow Devil, probably one of the most infamous, infamous uh, Wily creations ever. Devil-type robots are bastards. <laughs> you will this hate devil-type robots with a passion. Granted, I wouldn't say this is the worst of the bunch out there, but this is definitely one of the hardest. Oh, really? What do you say is the worst? and you're bad. Now, this is just the yellow rope. Yellow devil is an asshole unless you're cheesing. Or you're and really, cheesing. really good. I, I swore that for this recording, I would not cheese him. 
Because we told you we wouldn't do it if you did. Yeah. Anyway, would you like to explain how to cheese them, or shall I? Uh, go right ahead! Well, there's actually two pause buttons in this game. One that brings up the menu for weapon select, and the other one doesn't. The problem is, reset invulnerability timers don't re don't pause with it, so... By repeatedly pausing and unpausing, you can literally force him out of invulnerability with one shot. And because... With a piercing weapon, you can one-shot any enemy in this game, even Final Wily. It's very cheap. Though for yeah. this guy, I usually make an exception. Yeah, because once you do get the pattern down, it just becomes repeat ad nauseum. Ad nausea? Gesundheit. Because I'm already sick of this guy. Do you have to hit him in the eye? Yes. Yeah. If you try to Mega Buster him only without using the elect uh, beam, it's possible he can, when he opens his eye, it will be in a position where you can't even shoot it. And most of you're yeah, getting two I... damage per round, in which case, have fun doing tw almost 20 rounds of that. I think the exact number is 14. Uh. That's assuming he doesn't put it in an unreachable spot. Uh, you see why we don't part. like Yellow Devils? And that is why I'll say in people it's, to it kill it that. fairly easy and tedious. And that is why every sane people kill that boss with the uh, bow trick. Well, anyway, it's time for the boss refights, starting with Cutman. Seems a little bit early in his fortress for it. Yeah, here you don't actually have a rock to throw at him, so you have to do Mega Buster only. You don't have to, you can hit him with other things, I'm sure. But it's not nearly as effective. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can still. So, rock Buster really is the most effect. Okay, second most effective thing after actual rocks. Cutman's I mean, not very intimidating, Robot Master, is he? Of course, there's no nope. reason that. Of course, you know, if you're using a pause glitch, you could still hit him pretty easily with uh, his uh, with Electman's weapon. Well, which we're I assuming you're not going to cheese the system like that. Well, I wouldn't do that for uh, for cut, man. That'd be pretty desperate. Yeah. That might be taking a nuke to an anthill. A little bit overkill there. Are you intentionally taking damage? No, that's just they're really hard to dodge. Well, and by hard to dodge, he yeah. means he's Ozzy. Um, that looked pretty easy to dodge. That's why I asked if you were taking damage intentionally. You could have easily gotten away with Ozzy if you just said, no, I'm damage boosting, save time. Especially with me, because I have no idea what's going on in this game. <laughs> just because me and Chaos know you're taking all these hits and playing like a dumbass, you could save face for one of us, but nope. I appreciate your honesty, though. Though I will say this, I really don't like these series of rooms of only because... It's again, it's uh, rooms that the Octopus batteries are usually incredibly in the way. I still have to say those are some pretty dumb names, but whatever. And now it's and time it's for time... everyone's favorite boss. The clone Cut boss. Man. Yeah, literally, it's a copy of Mega Man. Whatever weapon you're currently using, he will be currently using. It's all sorts of fun to equip the super arm and just watch him try and do nothing. His actual pattern is just to walk left and right, shooting randomly, and jumping anytime you fire. Of course, he wins DPS races, so... Yeah. Make sure you actually hit him and dodge. 14, I think? We'll say 14. Yeah. Honestly, I don't like this boss. I don't know the pattern, so I cheesed them. Man, just told you the pattern. Oh, uh, you're cheesing him. You're pause tricking. Gee, I'd rather pause tricking for two guy. damage? And you're still not doing it very effectively. 
Well, this is not a very effective robot master to do it enemy to do it against either. His weakness, well, he doesn't really have a weakness, but most people agree Firestorm is the best weapon against him. Yeah, Firestorm's pretty effective, if only because Firestorm not only fires uh, a big ball of fire in front of you, but you also have like a ball of fire that circles around you while you're firing it. Of course, what's also effective is not teasing him with a bad weapon. I also like to look at Mega Man's model there, and it just looks like he's breathing a sigh of relief. You mean you just had to? Pause I, I, I think I think he's hold, he's he, he's closing his eyes in shame at the fact that he just paused to just his way through that boss. Yeah. Anyways, this is without a doubt the for yellow devil. Stage in the game. It's long and tedious and boring. Why did the room just change color? Oh my god, he's son it's filled with water. Sonic the robots. He can really move. How long does this go on for? Not very long. It's this A is while. This isn't the longest stage in the game by uh it's the shortest one by far. In fact, no, we're already here at the tunnel. boss. Right, here's the boss, HK-47. HK-47 is a really annoying robot. Yep. Which, it can come out of one of three entrances into the room to the right, the top, or the left. You mean the entrances. Which yeah. are pretty obvious. If it comes through the top one, it's very hard to avoid taking damage from because he's so large. And also, these bubbles don't have invisibility frames, so if you are very good at that, you... 15? Yeah, I think so. This is also a boss I have an extremely t a tough time telling where its shots are coming from because of the really bad sprite flickering. Is this sprite flickering on your TV? Because it seems fine to me. Yeah. No, it's... Don't you notice it during the gameplay? Well, that's what I was talking about. It, what I'm saying doesn't I was look say, the, the bubble and the I... shots flicker a little bit, but the core does not. No, I... it's, the, it's the shots that come out of the bubble itself. They flicker as well. He fires well, three shots. Guess, and they're I still easily I... followable. I mean, at least they still have a sprite. Some NES games would just remove shots, and you have to remember they're there. And that kind of is what happens here, and it's really distracting. No, I was able to follow them just fine. I I could see them in everything. Whatever, final stage. So, uh, hey, score reset runner. again. He got a game over. Considering this is the uh, the gauntlet room with all the bosses, yeah, I would die a game over. Can you blame me? So, 16? We can't. Now we gotta add more to the death counter. Question mark? Mm. Yeah, 16 is a good guesstimate. Okay, because I, I don't know how the lives work in this game. They work like extra lives, plain and simple. I mean, how many lives you get between continues, Ozzy? Two. Three. It's always two. They count zero, so it's technical. So I always say it's three. You die three times before you get a game over. Okay. By the way, I think he has a thing for guts, man. Just a hunch. Alright. And now for the hard part of the game the robot gauntlets. Yeah, Ball Man's not too hard. Uh, no, no, no. The hard one is coming up. So, didn't you say it was possible to do all the bosses with Buster only without taking damage? Yes. yes. But that's so. Big, why would it not be possible to do very that? Very trained player. <laughs> a, you have to know what you're doing. B, you've got to, you start off in an alcove rather than a flat room like 
most of the bosses. Some of them are, they're all still very aggressive, and you have to do I'm four of them not, in a row. I'm not saying it's easy. I'm just saying earlier, Matt, you said it was impossible to not die here, but if it's possible to do them all buster only without taking damage, why would it not be it, possible here? <laughs> also, seven. Because, because you have to do four of them in a row, which means all of them have to be done perfectly. And if one of them's done imperfectly, that's damage. If you and the damage just, carries over, there's no healing. And I'm just saying it's possible. I'm not saying it's easy, I'm saying it's possible. We're not arguing you against that. It's just you're you're setting the bar pretty high if you're trying to compare what? that give that I, to me. You're I'm saying this not, high for a good player. I'm I was merely asking if it was possible and nothing else. It is, and now you're saying everything in this game is possible. It's even more possible if you use the paw trick. I'll just stop, because apparently you guys are thinking I'm asking someone to do it. I'm just asking if it's possible. There are definitely some Mega Man games later down the line where, yeah, it's literally impossible to do certain things perfectly, just because it requires, like say, using a charge shot or using a particular weapon in order to progress. Tell that to speedrunners. Yeah, that's the boss gauntlet. Yep, up next is Dr. Wily himself. Dr. Wily? Or yep. Dr. Wily? I say Wily. Because he's a wily old coot, don't you know? Dr. Wily? And here's <laughs> his wily machine one. And it sweeps the firestorm. Ah! That's what I get for trying to put him at low health. 18? What the? I see a um, mouse. You're emulating this. Plus 99 deaths for emulator. I have no choice! 117. Your Wii and your 3DS disagree. And at the very least, edit it out. I thought I did. I edited most things out. Wily Machine 1, beat the Firestorm, hit the turrets so it stops moving. I think I, the reason why I did that is I wanted to make sure I was recording properly. Form 2, it's got no weakness. All attacks deal 1 damage, so you may as well use something that multi-hits. Right, for Rolling Cutter, Ozzy's going with Elect Beam. Well, it hit two times. Rolling cutter, if you can position it just right, you can get a third hit in, but that's exact. You have to get perfect positioning on that, whereas Lek Beam is always going to be two hits. So it's just going to come down to a matter of preference. Yep. Boom. And that's it. Game's over. We've defeated Dr. Wily, so let's go ahead and arrest him, take him to jail, and be done with this. And only 117 deaths. I think you... found it wrong at some point. Matt said plus 99 deaths for using emulator, so I added 99 to my 18. Because we cannot confirm if you use save states to cheat out death, so I have to be safe. Yay! Unfortunately, Doctor Why we got away. Oh no! He forgot to bring rope. I hope they get him for good next time. I did. I do admit to one save state I actually did during this run. Doesn't and matter. That was, you save that, state once. No, I save state once before de uh, dealing with uh, uh, Yellow Devil, so I could practice it. And so I could potentially show off the cheese strats, but I just said, nah, we'll just talk about it. And then you'd proceed to do it anyway. Yeah, but on a different boss. You never said, you just said, don't cheese Yellow Devil. You didn't say anything else about cheesing the other bosses. I assumed <sighs> you had enough playing skill to not need it. 
Apparently I was wrong again. It was Ozzy playing after all. Sorry for having some faith in humanity. He's and a Ozzy. real boy! Actually, no. He's a service robot. Still. He's an emulator. I have the game on my 3DS, it's just that I can't record off of it. You have a Wii? Yeah, reco recording from uh, DS and 3DS is a bit. Because you need to, like, uh, third party you... equipment for that shit, and they cost like a shit ton. You still were playing on emulator without disclosing at the start that you were playing on emulator. So, still plus 99 deaths. <laughs> 